Tracker's online. Confirming Goldie's on the Dast and Sacro scut. Seatbelts, everyone. We're going in hot. Crap. Hold on. Hold on. Got him! Alpha Hercules system. Inside the Keystone Asterism. Got it. Coordinates are in. We're not getting away this time. Power down! How the flark are we supposed to fight that? Hell yeah! No core! The world mine must have. Come on! I don't think they're with the world mine anymore. Cops flying next to pirates. Merchant vessels, military. Anybody who would have fought back's already here. Playing for the wrong team. Well, can't say we didn't try. Nikki's in there somewhere. There's got to be a way. Yes, we overpower them with our own vastly superior fleet. Well, regrettably, we do not have one. Guys, we do our best work when we're out of options. Somebody's got to have something. Drax. You have royal blood. Perhaps it is time for the Prince of Spartax to return and rally his people. You been to Spartax lately? I have not. But Spartoi technology is well beyond... Spartax was sacked during the war because of its tech. You can't even land there anymore. <laughs> Gamora, thoughts? Maybe Earth has heroes that can help us? Those guys in the pajamas? Mighty pajamas. Trust me, Earth hasn't caught up to everybody just yet. We need somebody with a fleet. <laughs> Groot, and no bad ideas. I am Groot. Yeah, that's a bad idea. We're not going to the Shatari. That is the kind of wild card we're looking for, just not that one. The snakes would shoot us in the back. Assuming they don't shoot us in the front. <laughs> Hold on. What if the answer's been slobbering right in front of us this entire time? This beast cannot operate a ship. That's not what I'm saying. Think about it. Cammy's pretty much useless to us, but she's also useless to the church. They want people to brainwash. I bet animals aren't even on their radar. They went after Cosmo. Cosmo's mind is way more advanced than ours. His intelligence makes him weak to the promise, just like Rocket. Thanks but not an animal. What I'm saying is we know someone with an entire beast army, and I bet Raker hasn't even looked twice at her. How can you be certain she is not one of them? I am Groot. Guardians of the gut! Nope, she's good. You do realize she still wants to flay us and feed us to her babies? Guys, this is it. Okay, our one last long shot. We've got to find a way to apologize and make things right. Okay, well, we'll get her a gift. A peace offering. I ain't going back in a cage. No, no, but think bigger. Way bigger. The one beast that you'd want more than any other. Drax knows what I'm talking about. Oh, yes! Oh, no, 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 no. Here it comes! You know where we're going. To Mach To battle the legendary Fin Fang Foom! say that the rings of Maku 4 perpetually rain fire down upon the godless abominations that dwell below. How fun. <laughs> I'm 
sure it's worse than it looks, too. It is. Many of my people braved this same treacherous pilgrimage before me, never to return. Mark, hang on to something! Quill parks, anyways. <laughs> we were not fated to die this day. Unless, of course, Fin Fang Foom devours us whole. <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. we gotta find him first. <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> oh, this is insane. This is how we park, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That definitely shouldn't be sparking! We can worry about that after we catch our dragon. And convince Lady Albender to help us bust the church a new one. Before setting out on our quest, let us rouse our spirits with a Katathian battle anthem. What? Like now? You know what? Flark it. Let's do it. Listen closely. Ancient Katathian is a powerful tongue with words that hold great meaning. Follow as I lead the melody. Trajo to plu, Helga Gor Morga, Soltas Flander Really? We're doing this? All right, let's do this. <laughs> Shivering tit, which is cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me? Or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fing Fang Foom. And the galaxy-saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Maybe Hellbender will go for it. Okay. Well, I ain't seeing no boom folk. We should look for Katathian hunt markers. Just a few. The legends of raining fire are true. Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death. Well, as long as it's glorious. I would like it. 
alive, and we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? Uh, maybe, but definitely not before that. Go team! Looks like a dead end. Glorious dead end. Gotta admit, I kinda love how excited you are about all this. Anyone else bothered by the cold? All right, Drax, let's channel some of that excitement on this rock. Uh, I shall pretend that it's the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great, Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Root says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be your last chance to take anything in. Think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. <coughs> Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. You can't remember the details because you didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. Look, my people were here. Didn't we see these in Drax's memories when Mantis linked us all together? They're Katathian hunt markers. That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken, physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Foon? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle, a truly glorious death. They came here to find purpose, didn't they? To reach Ultaf. Our talk on nowhere. We were paying attention. Of course. Many would have been traitors or criminals, surely bound for Sarduth. Some were diseased or dying. Coming all the way out here wounded and taking on the meanest monsters in the galaxy? They got my respect. And soon we shall have theirs. Like you know 
Voice dub version of Stumpy! No mention of Stumpy! Remember last time? This hardened exterior is quite sexy! Okay, so on a scale of 1 to 10, how much bigger and stronger and scarier is Foom gonna be than the thing we just fought? 10,000. That's what I think. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Gamora, I'm thinking I can get a pretty good vantage point from the top of this thing. Okay, just be careful, Peter. I can see the whole crater from up here. Maybe Foom's not in the mountain after all. Maybe he's down there somewhere. You tell us! I mean, if I were a dragon, I'd definitely want to stop around down there. The legends do tell that Fin Fang Fu stuck in Maku's greatest caldera. Good enough for me. We can probably work our way around the edge and find a way down. <gasps> Flark and Hala! Whoa. Get a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah. Um... When we find him? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here, too. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. How about Quill? <laughs> Come on, it's not so bad. His fleshy frame would make a poor instrument of demolition. Okay. I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right, and what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Incoming! So step two of your plan is crushing us all? I think I see what he's up to. Yeah, crushing us all! Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks, we can... <laughs> I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. Drax, I know you've been waiting for this a long time. Enjoy it, man. Thank you, Peter Quill. I must admit that with everything that has happened, I need this. Everyone get ready. There's something up ahead. I'm pretty sure it sees us. More boom food to deal with. Don't underestimate anything that survives the perils of this planet. Good advice. I wonder if Big Ben Boom's gonna spin eyes with fire at us! The mighty beast has several legendary attacks! I will not spoil the surprise! I did not come here for a quick and painless death! Shouldn't it be too cold for words on this planet? They've adapted! We need to do the same! Drash! Kick their foot! And the hunt for Fin Fang Fu continues. Okay. Let's just think things through a moment. Since when is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Breaker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Foom... There. See? More... ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not. The smart ones do. Fork! Way too close! <laughs> they say that Fin Fang Foom uses the planet's treacherous surface to test would-be adversaries. So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out! Now we're free. I want full credit for killing. Yes, killing tracks. We're not killing Fin Fang Boom. We're 
catching him to get the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. Seems complicated. down a legendary dragon with the fate of the entire galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold us up. Wow. I'm impressed. You really conquered the fear. Whatever they are, I'm thinking no! Then face them! These extra creatures will be no match for my eyes! You'd think the death of their king would scare them off! mid -tool. Loving the initiative. So glad you took the joke. So glad you took the joke. Held on to the Nice. Who won't know what hit him? We'll be more resilient than Bolton. I know. I'm just trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. You're the perfect team. Meh, we're okay. That's high praise coming from Murder Mom. Guys, there's so much at stake right now. I mean, if we don't get Lady Hellbender on our side, if we don't find a way to take down Raker and his flarked up church. We know, Peter. Staying positive, making the most of this adventure, it helps take the edge off by lessening the sense of crushing responsibility we've all taken on here. I will miss your terrible speeches, Peter Quill, when Fin Fang Foom devours us all. Right now. 
I mean, if we don't get Lady Hellbender on our side, if we don't find a way to take down Raker and his fucked up church... We know, Peter! Staying positive, making the most of this adventure, it helps take the edge off. This place is crumbling all around us! Yeah. Mm. Foom, you seen him? Big wings, nasty teeth, purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. Ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? This one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Felt that one too. And that one. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. Magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spot in Traxia. Step aside, mortals, and allow the Meltinator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Huh? Got a better one? Petey Hot Guns. No! Captain Fireball. It's not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat glob. Captain Heat Glob. No, no. It ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with fur. Root's practically naked. Root don't get cold, but he's a big baby in the heat. I'm Groot. Hey, we're all flammable. Yeah. 
smiles upon us this day, my friends. We just almost got crushed by a giant meteor. Indeed. Almost. Got you there. Up we go, group. I'm Groot. You can stop there. Thanks. I swear, Quill, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? Oh, yeah. Where they go? What the flark? It might be his name. Maybe he's trying to communicate. Please don't. Star Lord! See? <laughs> Star Lord! Is it just me, or did he sound a little irritated? No, there was definitely hatred in that voice. <laughs> Always the charmer, Quill. Check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Groot says watch out for those plants with all the holes on top. I imagine Groot would sense our arrival rush to face us. Burn, baby, burn! Ha <laughs> Nice! I ain't ever gonna get tired of that. Keep your eyes peeled. Smell an ambush. Your senses must be finely tuned. I smell nothing. Though we are clearly still being stalked by the snow beasts. They ain't exactly subtle. Wendigo! Yeah, that's what I thought. Sure. Those things grow in a frozen hellscape. I think they're made of sturdier stuff than that. Ah! It burns! Root says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. Yeah, I think we've earned a vacation. Preferably on a normal planet where nothing's trying to kill us. Keep it up. My shirt's starting to get warm. You think Golden Boy is getting tortured right now? More likely Warlock is torturing Raker. The Golden One is formidable. I think what, Quill? It's your new best bud. I'd say communication has failed. Another, up there. Wendigo! Just meet a 
nice, Rocco. Perhaps they are more amenable with time. This has got my name on it. Gamora, stop it! We I have a sweet call for the big silver return to the skirmish, Jax. Rock it! Blast them! Flash! Destroy! When did go home? Get it? Clever work, play, Peter Quill. The same is said of me! Ah! A good fight warms the blood! I still don't know how you do this shirtless! What's next, Peter? Hold him down, crew! Why can't we ever just meet a nice local? Okay, I'm done playing with the snow monkeys. Wendigo. Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling Wendigo. See? Sounds like we haven't seen the last of them. Maybe Hellbender will want to add some of those Wendigo to her army. Assuming they don't hold a grudge.
rocks at us! Let us return the favor! That wreck is the camp we saw? Uh, this thing has been here for ages. Look, the smoke's coming from the other side. We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there. All right, Groot, give me a boost. I am Groot. About yay high. Yay is not a unit of measure. Groot knows what he means. Drop something down for you guys. I never truly believed this day would come. Look out below! Here, give me a hand. We should be ready. We don't know the source of that smoke. Or hostiles. Maybe it's just a nice warm fire and some cigar and spirits. Ooh, maybe it's a barbecue. What? Barbecue? What? You guys have never had barbecue? Charbroiled burgers, grilled steaks, baby back ribs? Whatever it is, it smells... Bodies. It smells of bodies. Jeez. Was all this foo? Undoubtedly. Tentacle orb is her head. And I can hear you with it. Are you the only survivor? Clearly not. Who are you, Meat Sacks? We're here for film. Forget what I said. Yeah, I'm the only survivor. Or will be. I take it you know where we can find him? Sure. Digesting my men back at his roost. Big Eyes Obelisk sticking out of the Caldera's frozen sea. Don't worry, we'll take care of Foom. Sure you will, Terran. Just don't come running back here when he chases you. You still got some things to pack up. You gonna be okay? I don't need your pity, Terran. I'll head back to Contraxia and lick my wounds. Ooh, hey, you may not want to do that. Contraxia isn't exactly safe right now. <laughs> when is it ever? Seriously, maybe you should just come with us. I've been embarrassed enough today without taking help from a stranger. I can look after myself. Well, if you hear people talking about a promise with a matriarch, just steer clear. I'll keep that in mind. The 
sorry about your men. Eh, dead men collect no paychecks. Speaking of, aren't you the Mad Titan's daughter? May as well put it to good use, right? They ain't using it. Done in record time. Here's hoping we do better against Boom than this lot. Big ice thingy on the frozen sea, eh? You said it, buddy. Sure is a long way down. Let's see what we can make with the parts you've got. Gotcha covered. Ah, got a crick in my back because of that. Um, any of you corpses mind if I help myself to your stuff? No? Well, thank you. Another hunt marker? This one is unclaimed. No doubt it belonged to one of these corpses. Guess they never got the chance to plan it. I have appropriated it for our own use, to herald our bravery this day shall mark our ultimate conquest, or our glorious defeat. Foon may be bad news, but he's nothing compared to the fight that comes next. It shall mark our penultimate conquest. One conquest at a time. All right, people. Let's catch us a dragon. Yes. We grow ever closer to our great destiny. You're awful, Chipper, considering Boom obliterated that camp like it was nothing. We are not nothing. I'm a Drax. Whoa! Hey, Keen, the ice is amplifying our velocity! This is how I die! Ah! Have you lost your fortune, mind? Come on! If you forget it's incredibly dangerous, it's actually kind of fun! <laughs> well, that takes care of the getting down part. I don't even want to think about how we're going to get back up. Or how we're going to get boom up there. Guys, come on! We ride a dragon! Ride. Boom! I hear old me would be so jealous right now. You think Foom is gonna let us ride him after we kick his butt? You're getting all caught up in the details. We could be dragon riders. Dragon riders! So, what was up with old Bubblehead? Seemed like an augment to me, some sort of amorphous biochemical appendage. Ooh, I didn't think it could get any colder. You know, it's days like these I'm glad I installed seat warmers in the Milano. Up ahead, there's the ice obelisk. This must be it, the frozen sea. This is the perfect spot. Here we will challenge the great beast. Fin Fang Foom, come and face your death. What are you doing? We can't get the drop on him if he knows we're here. Also, we're not killing him, remember? Shout with me. Here we demonstrate our metal. Fin Fang Foom! Your end draws near! Nope, not his end. Your quill. Go! Uh, fin Fang Foom, it's... Nap time! <laughs> Rocket, it's your turn! Did he just say my real name? Rocket! Fin Fang Foom! We're gonna decomboggle your flock and scut spigots! You hear me? He hears you! You scaly, overgrown gordel splode! You fessant lump of Satarki and shrub meat! You don't scare us! It feels good, does it not? Yeah! Yeah! It actually does! No! We disrobe! Yeah, we're not 
not doing that. 